MD Griffin, thanks so much for joining us. We began tonight with a push to complete the U.S. Census every 10 years. The census provides a population count of people in the United States. The census allocates two things, financial power and political power. But as the November, nope, excuse that, September 30th deadline approaches, the governor is urging Georgians to fill it out fast. Arjit Sashadri reports from our Atlanta bureau. With less than a week to go until the 2020 census deadline, Georgia Governor Brian Kemp is encouraging all Georgians to fill out this year's census. The governor says Georgia has one of the lowest census response rates in the country, and that could impact federal funding. Literally, the states could not be higher. So today, as I've done several times throughout the pandemic, I'm issuing a call to action for Georgians to do the right thing, fill out your 2020 census. That money could go to things like road and transportation projects, health care, hospitals, and school programs. The governor says there's about $675 billion in federal funds that Georgia could gain for the next 10 years. The governor also says that the census represents political power, accurately counting Georgia's population so that we get an equal representation in Congress. Our rural assistance program receive critical resources based on response rates. In the Peach State's congressional representation in Washington is directly tied to how many Georgians take part in the census. The governor says the census will not ask for your political affiliation or your citizenship status, but it may ask you things like your age, gender, and how many people live in your home. Right now, about a million Georgians are still yet to complete the 2020 census, which is due by September 30th. Reporting at the Georgia State Capitol, Archit Sashadri, Atlanta Bureau Chief.